Okay for breakfast, right? I have peanut butter. And what goes with peanut butter? Shout it out! It's jelly! Peanut butter and jelly go together! I've got a lot of sandwiches to make. Can you help me? Great! Pretend to make sandwiches with me. Set out two pieces of bread. One, two, Good job! Now scoop up some peanut butter. Gloop, gloop. Then spread it on the bread. Swish, boosh, swish, boosh. Now scoop up some jelly. Scoop. Quick! Spread it on the bread before it slides off. Slip, slop, slip, slop, slip, slop. Now stick the pieces together. We did it! We made a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. My friends are going to be so excited. Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Manny. Who? Who? Making peanut butter and jelly, are you? Hi, Ollie. I sure am. I can't wait to give my friends a surprise breakfast. Breakfast is great. It's true. I know of another surprise breakfast, too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. Oh, hi, friends. I'm Justin the Mailman. I just finished a long walk delivering mail, and now I'm really hungry. It's almost my lunchtime. Hmm. What should I have for lunch today? Should I have spaghetti and meatballs? Or macaroni and cheese? Or peas and carrots? Oh, maybe I should have some fish. Did you know some people eat fish for breakfast? That reminds me of today's true story from the Bible. Do you want to hear it? Great. Let me just put the story mail in the mailbox. Today, we're going to talk about what happened after Easter. Easter started out sad. Jesus died and was put in a tomb. But did he stay in there? No! Jesus came back just like he said he would. Jesus is alive. Jesus is alive. Soon after that, some of Jesus' friends were fishing. All of a sudden, they saw Jesus standing on the beach. They were so excited to see him. Show me your excited face. Yes, good job. Jesus cooked fish and told his friends to come and have breakfast with him right there on the beach. They were so happy to be with their good friend Jesus again. They knew that Jesus loved them and that he would always be their friend forever and ever. And there's more good news. 
Jesus loves you so much, and he wants to be your friend forever too, forever and ever. That is so awesome. Jesus is alive, and he wants to be your friend forever. Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye. So there's your story. And it's all true. Jesus came back to see his friends. And he wants to be your friend forever, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow. Jesus made a special breakfast for his friends and told them that he wanted to be their friend forever. Jesus wants to be our friend forever, too. I think I've got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? and jelly go together. But the best things that go together are my friend Jesus and me. See you next time. Bye.